Welcome back, everyone. A North Charleston officer is being called a hero after his quick action helped a child survive a fall from a moving vehicle. A week after the incident, doctors confirmed she's making a speedy recovery. The officer recou recounts this harrowing experience. The child first, uh, get that child picked up out of the roadway, make sure nothing else happens. Officer Marzen says he was just around the corner at Trident Medical Center when he got a harrowing call. The child was possibly not in the car seat and opened the door and just the, the force of the vehicle going around the exit ramp you know, threw the child out of the vehicle. The vehicle was attempting to exit I-26 East onto University Boulevard at the time. When Marzen got to the scene, he and a witness immediately began first aid. The child did lose her right arm due to the force of the turn. She was scared. Um, until, you know, until the tourniquet was applied, then, you know, um, she she broke down at that point. EMS arrived shortly after and took the girl to MUSC Sean Jenkins. Doctors confirmed they were able to reattach the little girl's arm and save her life. Speaking with the surgeon and the family at the hospital, um, they said if it was a minute later that it probably would have been tragic. Nearly a week later, she's already made remarkable progress. It's six days and she's already starting to get feeling back in her, her her fingers and arms already. It's just amazing. Not every call you go to is a happy ending. Um, this one here is, is a little different. The South Carolina Highway Patrol confirmed the driver, 36-year-old Ebony Myers, faces citations for child restraint violation and not having a driver's license. SCHP is continuing this investigation. And this isn't the first time Marzen has jumped into action. On your screen is a video from June of last year showing the officer rescuing a man trapped in a burning car. Wow.